Do you live in the city of Cincinnati? You better cut that lawn this week. A new city law has just started handing out huge fines to homeowners who don't keep their lawn trimmed. But one man thinks it goes too far. Bill Fraley shows me the notice that showed up on his mom's front door here in her Clifton Heights home. This was applied to the door. They never knocked? Nobody knocked. His older mom, who's on disability and struggles to get around, had not trimmed her yard yet this spring. But what he thought would be a simple warning was anything but. No warning whatsoever. Just a ticket. Just a ticket taped to her door. And what a ticket it was, $500 from the city of Cincinnati. Borderline enraged that it, it feels like a cash grab suddenly, $500 for someone on the street. Clearly, no one on the street would be able to make a $500 so what is going on here? Can you really be fined $500 for letting a few weeds grow too tall in your yard? Well, we decided to come to Cincinnati City Hall for some answers. But no one wanted to speak on camera. City Manager Harry Black referred us to spokesperson Rocky Murs, who explained by email this is part of a new law passed last year to fight property blight. He says the city received a formal complaint and found grass in weeds exceeding 10 inches, which violates the new law. Result, a $500 fine, though it can be reduced to $250 if the yard gets trimmed. Bill Fraley, though, thinks his mom should have been warned. Even if you don't want to talk to her, at least pay something on the door that says... Fix it in seven days or we will fine you. Not, it's $500, and if you don't pay it in seven days, it goes to 1000 You know, we're going to stay on this story and share our report with some city council members tomorrow. I'll let you know if they think the fine fits the crime.